pick up the pace. One time, me and my friends, we, I live in New Hampshire, near the seacoast, or at least that's where I grew up. I live in the Lakes region now, but um, when I was a kid in high school, one summer, we drove like six hours up to the northern part of Vermont, up to like the Burlington area, to go, why are you healing me? I'm cloaked. What are you doing? Are you, who is this guy? Who is this? Star... You're getting the EMP, whoever you are. Star coma. You don't heal and close the bread, do you? Do you? Anyway, we drove up to the northern part of Vermont in the middle of the night, like five of us in a little Dodge Omni, because they we went we were gonna pick. We came we went with trash bags full to pick this um, hemp field, which was a vestige of um, when hemp was farmed for. Uh, for rope and paper so we came back with these just hundreds of pounds of wild hemp thinking it was marijuana completely not psychoactive full of seeds uh, a couple days later my friend's dad found our fucking gigantic stash of this stuff this material curing and drying and in a panic I'll never forget he's he's uh he was trying to like burn it in the in the furnace in the house as quickly as possible because that's a that would be a huge fine in jail time for that many, that much marijuana and it, I mean the cops don't know the difference between hemp and actual weed so so I remember how fun it was though like picking just copious amounts of buds not realizing that it wasn't real and uh, that's what Giacomo gets to do fucking at the end of the summer is just fucking <laughs> picking buds so fun we had an acquaintance that that uh, took one of our friends' stash from that nighttime raid up in Burlington and cured it with sugar, and allegedly made it so that it was semi psychoactive. But even then, it's, it was so full of seeds, and it was it was just gross. It was like so gross. I'm playing in Europe, this is pretty playable, right? You miss me, bitch. Looks like a rocketeer is a bruiser. I am right there. He's shooting at me. 
Yeah, take that, punk. <laughs> Talking such a fun time. It's super relaxing. It's about as relaxing as Counter Strike Global Offensive is stressful. They're at the opposite ends of the spectrum. I don't think I've ever been stressed out in a Hawken game. Not because of Hawken, anyway. Shit, Counter Strike's so brutal, though. They're so fucking. The stakes are so high for so many kids that <laughs> you go a little crazy with the stress of it all. How'd I do? Shitty. Super shitty. This star Corona guy. Jesus Christ. You f I know dedicated tags are like an actual fucking thing among some people. But at least... I mean, if you're not going to kill anything, at least use your brain and don't fucking follow a cloaked predator in the open on last eco into the heart of the enemy line. <laughs> that was the dumbest shit ever. It defeats the whole pr purpose of the predator, right? I mean, you're supposed to be invisible. There's a big fucking arrow pointing to you while you're invisible from your teammate. And he shows up on the radar because he's running that heat gun. <laughs> 